the voice you must learn to heed is the voice of the Spirit. The Spirit's voice is ever-present, but it is calm. In your generation, you will be barraged by multitudes of voices telling you how to live, how to gratify your passions, how to have it all. There will be all sorts of software, satellite receivers and communication networks that will suffocate you with information. You will be bombarded with evil and wickedness like no other generation. Where is the wisdom we have lost in knowledge? Where is the knowledge we have lost in information? Listen to and follow the voice of the Spirit. of dopamine coming up from the brain to the striatum in the presence of drugs or booze or gambling or sex or porn or pizza or whatever it is they are addicted to. And um, so the striatum is activated and becomes focused on it. Or that happens again and again and again. And it happens in response to cues or stimuli that are connected to the activity of choice, the thing that you want.
time come for you to be your own man and take on the world, and you did. But somewhere along the line, you changed. You stopped being you. You let people stick a finger in your face and tell you you're no good. And when things got hard, you started looking for something to blame. Like a big shadow.
said, how do you know? How could you know? God taught me. He has a plan. God. Yes. The God. Yes. I know how this sounds. It sounds crazy. Something told me to turn on the radio. Something told me to come here. My voice on the radio. You were trying to kill yourself. You were trying to kill And I got here just in time to save your life. It's just a coincidence. You must have sent me here for a reason. The world is quieter now. Just in case. I can hear God's plan.